Hey guys, welcome back to episode 2 of my Let's Play some edits. Where I'm gonna actually Let's Play instead of Let's Perfect here. Edits are a lot harder, unfortunately. But, glad to see you back here. Um, I'm, I haven't stopped playing the, or uploading Future Tones, but I'm just taking a short little break while I get more accustomed to uh, the 30 frames in uh, these older game series. And also to how much more stamina you need playing edits, since uh, whew, I, I've been practicing this uh, past week and my thumbs are noticeably weaker. <laughs> Either that or I'm getting old. One or the other. Anyways, we're gonna play a couple of nice uh, classics here that were really popular. Uh, France will be one of them. Actually, no, I'll save Triple Baka for another day. I, I want to play some new songs too, but I want to play some classics. Uh, so we'll look up here. I believe we will first do this one here. This uh, was also made uh, way back then in uh, Project Diva F. Oh yeah, and in case you're wondering why the menu looks a little bit different, this is F second the uh, successor to the F, the one that I showed you last time in my previous episode. As you can see, all the scores are showing up now. And it looks shinier, sort of. Alright, fortunately I still have to find the MP3 manually. Sometimes it picks it for me right away, but sometimes it does not. Uh, luckily I play these edits uh, so much I, I remember where they are in my massive list of MP3s. Anyways, this one is... Uh, called the six trillion years it's not actually Miku singing it's uh, Ia this is uh, there's like two versions there was an original regular 10 star and then a 12 star you could say is what the editor made it this is the 12 star version that I'm gonna try here and you get me uh, see me get me shredded <laughs> this one is actually really hard let's see if I can get an excellent at least this is uh, one of those really popular edits back then. I'm not sure how much I can talk while playing this edit. Alright. Got the first tech zone. Like I said, if you haven't played these games here before, those tech zones are pain. As soon as they pop up, you make any mistake. Bam. Minus 3% of your score. In the official songs, they place them in a more reasonable area. But in edits, where you can put it anywhere you want, most people will put it in uh, really hard score parts. You can also uh, have more than two. The default is two. But you can have up to nine if you want to. And a lot of hardcore edits, they, uh, <laughs> they love to put the 9. <laughs> oh god. Alright, now it's pretty bad there. What's up here? Ia is a, uh, another Vocaloid, not officially in this game, but she got her own game on Vita, where there's like, I know at least 30 of her songs, and this is like, one of the most popular songs that she has, and guess what, <laughs> it's not on that game, because of that, I was so disappointed when I found out the song was on it. The ending of the song is where everything has to go through shit for me. Yeah, 
shit on. Oh god. Oh, that's good. Would have gone and grave, but hit okay. that chance time stir. Yep. Yeah, I missed it. Chance time, zero points. Ah, that's another big negative in this game. If you miss songs, you're not gonna have a problem missing it, but in the edits, it's an easy miss it sometimes. You lose a five percent. Oh my god, I got destroyed. Funny enough, uh, only one person that I know of has ever actually perfected this song. And he doesn't even play the uh, this game series uh, seriously. Yeah, I found out about the game like one day because he streams a variety of games. His name is uh, Bananasaurus Rex on Twitch. If you know him, <laughs> and then he got into this uh, edits and stuff. Yeah, I showed him this edit, and then he practiced it nonstop, or not nonstop really, but I would say maybe a week or two, and then he got the perfect. And that's pretty. That's pretty funny <laughs> and ironic since he doesn't even play this game serious. He's just really talented. Anyways, all right, next song. Hmm. I think uh, I think we're ready for Francine. Let's do it. Now this one I have a semi decent chance of getting perfect. I have to concentrate pretty hard for these per uh, edits though to get the perfect. They just come like non-stop the notes, so like you barely have like any time to just just, just chill basically. Oh crap, push the wrong button. Alright, we're good. So this one is another uh, really popular one from uh, the original game F. Made Almost four years ago now. Despite it being so old, though, this is like use of the PV creator uh, creation that you can possibly do in this game. Oh, nice! As soon as I find the song here, this is a classic and must play for anybody that owns this game series. It's on F second and F. Both English and uh, Japanese, so it doesn't matter which version you have. Alright, here we go. you never seen this before. When you're in for a treat, why don't you try and figure out what's going on in the PV? <laughs> No breaks at all to talk, except the stars.
think I was gonna get that. <laughs> Not sure what Miku's doing there at the end there, but... Yeah! Oh, a new record. Amazing. Looks like all the Future Tone helped me with the cools. See, before I started playing Future Tone, I never cared about cools, ever. I just uh, cared about getting the perfect on the edit. But uh, since only cools is what matters in Future Tone, I guess it's uh, paying off slightly, since I would never get uh, this kind of cools usually. I think my average was 10% in uh, F second, but that right there was, I think, just under 5% uh, fines. Pretty good. Here you go. There's Francium. How are you feeling? That's the first time we just saw that. Hopefully that wasn't too much for you guys. <laughs> but like I said, that one's a really popular one. Almost uh, everybody that's played this. Two new ones that I have not played on my YouTube yet. Alright, here we go. Uh, we're gonna first play this new one that I found recently. I've been trying to get the perfect on it, but... I can't play it very long because I get headaches if I play this one too much. Just to give you an idea of what kind of song it is. <laughs> but I don't know, it's pretty good. Fun, I would say. It's called Gossip. Alright, here we go. May have to turn down the volume though. Hold on, let me see how loud it's gonna blast my ears here. Turn it down just a bit. This uh, creator right here, Snake Size, he made a lot of good edits, uh, even back then in F. And his edit of the Miku, let's say the P names, is what I saw, like as the first edit on YouTube, that inspired me to like basically play edits nonstop. Because when I saw how difficult it was compared to the official songs, I was just like. That's it, man. I gotta stop playing official songs. Only edits for me now. Yeah, that's what happened. Anyways, he, he's basically... Uh, that made the edit that I saw on YouTube. It was this uh, easy tune guy. It was his gameplay I saw of it. Why this one's not too bad. Just have to not fumble. Pushing the right buttons helps, that's for sure. First time I played this, I, I was laughing so hard. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most unexpected edit I have ever played. Never would have expected this in a million years. My talk. No. Oh, whatever. I was uh, just reading this casually in my uh, stream uh, when I first found this edit. Nobody was expecting this kind of music. You wouldn't expect it from this like type of music in the beginning. And when the drops come, <laughs> it's just so unexpected.
accidentally again. Man, I miss all this uh, pep talk at the end of the song. These vocalists give you when you uh, see your score. Try to make you feel better. In future, tell me you just get to see your score, that's it. <laughs> no pep talk, no cheer ups from the vocaloids. It's just like, here's your shitty score, guy. Play again. But in this one, you could like do a standard and then uh, you could be like, yeah, great job. Alright, one last song here. Uh, again, this will be another new song that I've uh, recently played too. This one's made by Bass Cannon. That's right, Bass Cannon. I'm playing your edit. Where, where is it? Here it is. For you guys that never play these game series, like, I know when you first see like all these amazing edits with the PV and stuff, and then you're like so motivated to like buy the game because you want to create your own PVs, but I'm gonna tell you right now, Unless you uh, literally don't have a job <laughs> or a girlfriend or boyfriend, you're not gonna be able to make a good PB. It, it just takes so much time and patience to learn the mechanics of the like the the editor, and there's no the tutorial doesn't teach you shit about how to use it. You have to be prepared to dedicate your life to making a good PB, basically. So if you're prepared to do that, then yes. You should buy this game to make your own PVs. <laughs> Otherwise, don't expect too much. This is why if you just randomly uh, look at PVs or edits that you uh, download off the network from other people, it's uh, nowhere near as good. I would say only about 5% of the edits are considered good that have a PV and a chart. What happens is a lot of people, they just learn how to make good charts because they just want to play you know, the song or make uh, charts for songs that they love. Uh, where is this? Here this. So what they do is they either just make a, a, a standard uh, background wallpaper or maybe just pose the vocaloid still and then it's just kind of like a blank wallpaper. Kind of like how people play Osu, they just have like a wallpaper or a blank screen or a black screen. Most of the people just play a black screen, which you could do if you wanted to in this one. Uh, this is an example of that. There's no PV for this. It's a cop-out PV, but still it's a pretty interesting song. Not sure why there's a tiara on uh, Miku here, but let's go ahead. <laughs> I just want to say that, prepare to be amazed, guys. I know all the lyrics to this song by heart. You ready for this? I feel you. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Alright, hold on. There we go. <laughs> What? As rig. Oh god. What the? <laughs> All right, that's it. I won't sell it for this. Let me at least get that part. God damn. I'm practicing the song too. Oh my. What? What is that? I swear I hit that star. This is this is why I hate Link stars so much in this game. You can't tell where the hell they're gonna hit. Oh my god! I'm just gonna spam it, whatever. I'm too tilted now. <laughs> Alright, sorry about that. I just need like three more minutes to finish the song. 
pretty much wraps up this episode. All right, last try. Here we go. God damn, what time is it? 22 minutes. Man, so much for my 20 minute rule. <laughs> I nailed it. <laughs> Thank you guys very much. Hope you enjoyed this episode. And the uh, next to last play will be the future tone. And then I'll go back to this one and alternate. And some of you guys have been asking if I will do requests of their edits. I will, but not until later on. Because I still have quite a lot of songs I still want to do first. So I'll let you guys know when I'm uh, available to take requests for my uh, edit Let's Plays. Have a good day. I peel you.